overflowing garbage and a revolving door of tenants. Neighbors say this quaint two story home on Stockton Circle in Linden has turned the once quiet cul de sac upside down. There's banging going on in the middle of the night. There's cars around the circle like it's a like it's a drive through drug dealership. My wife's afraid to come home. We've had a scuffle on the front lawn. We've had two overdoses. I can't believe that there's so much trouble here. One man. That one man, former Mets player Lenny Dykstra. The 55-year-old retired in 96, but he's been in and out of jail. In Linden last year, he pleaded not guilty to charges of making terroristic threats to an Uber driver and possession of cocaine and methamphetamine. One neighbor who didn't want to go on camera says he threatened her too, saying, quote, I'll bring hell to your doorstep over a fence. Councilwoman Gretchen Hickey shared with us ads that Dykstra allegedly posts advertising advertising $1,000 a month rent for each room in his home. She says there's been up to 10 tenants at a time. Mr. Dykstra has been to court uh, and with being told that he needs to evict all his boarders, he continued to advertise even after he was fined for it. We spoke with Dykstra's attorney by phone. Has he tried to speak with them? I know that he wants to make amends with the neighbors, and I know that he wants to make sure everybody's okay. We tried to speak with Dykstra, even tweeting at him. His reply, you think this maybe just maybe has bigger long-term implications for humanity? I don't care if it's Lenny Dykstra or anybody else. We're not going to tolerate this kind of behavior in our community. City code inspectors visited last month. The councilwoman says Dykstra was fined for having multiple rooms, all with locks that Dykstra could not open. He is due in court February 19th. In Linden, New Jersey, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News.